Hi, it's Ben. Um, I just thought I'd make a quick video uh, because I've had an idea for Web Design from Scratch Premium and I wanted to run it past you guys. I've got a chicken with me. Um, so I'll take you through the, the thinking. So I've been wondering, thinking about different businesses of different sizes and how, what is the appropriate way for us to do marketing in the light of web design is dead, as in the, the old way of um, putting so much labor and you know, building these websites by hand, which is very expensive, very laborious. Um, and, and the fact that in the last few years, we've had this tipping point where it's now not only cheaper and more convenient and faster to, to make a website using pre-made components like the, the WordPress platform and the themes and all the great stuff that you can get with that, but it's also better. The result is actually better than you can make by hand because the industry has just evolved and it's got more, more mature. So with that in mind, I've been pondering about what the implication is of all that to businesses of different sizes. And um, I think clearly it's, it's no longer in anyone's interest to pay a big chunk of money just for a website. Okay? Because the other thing that, of course, has changed over time is that we've got all these other amazing channels. So we've got from things like eBay and Etsy and Facebook and Pinterest. You can, you can run your businesses now sometimes on these other Web 2.0 or social channels you don't necessarily you know have to do everything via a single website so where does that leave us well i think i think that there's there's kind of a clear divide um for me so i think for the for the bigger companies for your say hundred thousand dollar plus turnover businesses the the right way for them to to proceed is going to be the web pro 2 approach um I'm still working this through. It's very, very exciting times uh, with the first few clients. I've got some, some partners who are interested in, in using this approach as well. Uh, and that's going to be using a combination of some professional fees, um, some kind of target-based uh, revenue share, and, and some uh, pure profit sharing. So I'm convinced that that is the future for for your larger businesses, but literally the economy of scale literally just kicks in um, to there. So smaller businesses just aren't going to have the level of turnover now or have the capacity for increased uh, growth and profits to make it that appealing for uh, consultants and designers and marketers to, to work on that revenue share basis. So what is the appropriate thing then for small smaller businesses to do. So if it's not to um, you know, pay a big chunk of money using the old Web Pro version 1 approach, and if it's not to use the, the Web Pro 2 approach, what should small businesses be doing? And I, I really think that I'm convinced that the right answer is to, to do your own, to a degree. Or at least have some kind of combination of um, putting your own, doing your own skills, you know, for your social media, your writing, your blogging, conversion optimization, possibly a lot of this stuff. But and also to do that in collaboration, maybe with some guidance from a consultant like me, um, or you know, your local web designer. But certainly not to be paying that kind of, you know, hundreds of dollars, thousands of dollars every month for for your marketing work. So, <clears throat> with this all in mind then, I, I think that there's a, an opportunity and a, a, and a need for information for small business owners to say, well, how do you do your own online marketing? Should you have a website? Should you be using Facebook? Should you be using pay-per-click ads? Should you be doing SEO? You know, how do you make these decisions? How do you decide on what the, what's the right thing to do? Um, and, you know, I, I think that's something I'd love to make some content about. So my idea is to create another stream within Web Design from Scratch Premium because we've already got, you know, 
um, HTML and CSS and copywriting and WordPress and um, SEO material and a lot of that is going to be really really helpful for small business owners but I think I'm I'm definitely considering creating another stream in there for people like you to say to help you through these important decisions so I would love to get your feedback please leave a comment um, under this video and uh, you know hopefully we'll uh, we'll make something happen with this thank you very much for listening Thank you.